Did you know eating eggs with some foods may damage your brain cells and maybe cause dementia? Although eggs are seen as a superfood, how you cook them and what you eat them with really matters. Today we'll reveal three things you should never eat with eggs because of their bad pairings and highlight three amazing foods that not only prevent dementia but also improve your eye health. Eating habits are mostly to blame for this growing problem since they greatly affect our overall health. Every food has good pairings that help nutrient absorption and bad mixes that could hurt our bodies. The best thing for our long-term health is to know this link between different foods and use this knowledge in our diets. Today we'll focus on eggs, known for their high quality protein, minerals, vitamins, and other nutrients. Eggs have been praised for their nutrition, offering iron and zinc, as well as important amino acids and vitamins A, D, E, and B. But depending on what you eat with eggs, your health may suffer, and even serious diseases like dementia and cancer could happen. That's why in this video we'll show three items you should never eat with eggs to prevent these bad health effects, and also talk about the three best ways to eat eggs for the most health benefits. First, let's look at the foods you should never have eggs with. Many people eat a lot of egg bread, and flour and eggs are indeed main parts of bread. But this mix is bad for preventing cancer and dementia. Choline, a type of vitamin B in eggs, helps with memory and focus. It makes up to 30% of brain cell parts, boosting brain activity to improve thinking. Choline also lowers body inflammation, which may help prevent cancer, but when you eat bread, which is mostly carbs, your blood sugar rises fast and makes sugar toxins. These toxins attack brain cells, so over time, your brain health could get worse. Eating bread and eggs together is like a war in your body. The choline in eggs tries to protect brain cells, while the sugar toxins from bread try to break through and cause damage. If you often eat noodles, bread, egg tarts, spaghetti, white rice, and already have high blood sugar, the problem is even worse. Choline can't protect us when your body is already stressed with too much insulin resistance and long-term inflammation. This inner fight can lead to heart problems like high blood pressure and hardened arteries, issues with insulin leading to diabetes, and long-term inflammation that can cause cancer, dementia, and other brain diseases. Instead of eating eggs with white flour foods, choose whole wheat bread or healthy plant-based breads not made from refined flour. These options have more fiber and nutrients, which help keep blood sugar normal and lower the risk of bad effects. Some people eat eggs and drink soy milk together for breakfast or to lose weight. Some also make warm soy soup and put a raw egg in it to eat. But eggs and soy milk shouldn't be mixed because of a substance in soy milk that stops a needed digestive process. This substance reacts with a part of egg whites and breaks down the nutrients. Eggs have great protein that helps older people avoid muscle loss and makes muscles stronger. They also have lots of vitamins and minerals. When eaten with soy milk, these good nutrients can't be absorbed well, so you lose many of the health benefits of eggs. If your throat feels tight when eating eggs, it's much better to have them with regular milk or water instead of soy products. This will help you digest better and absorb more nutrients. Drinking tea after eggs when your throat feels dry and tight makes the tannins in tea mix with egg proteins to form new compounds. This slows down digestion, makes your gut environment worse, and leads to constipation. Even more worrying, it makes your body absorb more toxic stuff. The scariest part is that this mix might make your body absorb more harmful things, causing health problems over time. So you should never drink tea or soy milk with eggs. To avoid these bad reactions, it's best to have eggs with water or milk. Now let's look at the best foods to eat with eggs. 1. Pumpkin Eggs and pumpkins go great together, especially since the protein in eggs helps our body absorb nutrients. When you eat pumpkin fiber with the calcium in eggs, it triggers a system in your body that helps you feel calm and less anxious. It also reduces physical stress, so it steadies your body and mind. Eating eggs with pumpkin helps lower stress and tiredness in the body. Some say stress causes all diseases. This mix may especially help people with stressful lives or anxiety problems. Also, eating pumpkin, which your body turns into vitamin A, 
is very good for our health. Working with other nutrients in eggs, it acts as a strong antioxidant that not only protects your eyes, but can also greatly lower the chance of getting eye diseases like glaucoma and macular degeneration. If your eyes have been blurry or your vision cloudy, try eating eggs with pumpkin. This mix might help your eye health get better and maybe prevent vision problems in the future. Try making pumpkin egg rolls, tarts or pancakes, and pumpkin egg soup. These foods taste good and also give you lots of nutrients that help your overall health. 2. Cheese Besides tasting good, cheese is the best match for eggs nutrition-wise. Eggs have many nutrients, but not much calcium compared to dairy products. Since dairy has lots of calcium, it goes perfectly with eggs. They work especially well together because cheese is made by fermenting milk. This process lowers the protein content, letting you balance your nutrition without eating too much protein. For people trying to eat more protein without overloading their system, cheese and eggs are a perfect mix. Try cheese omelets, quiches with different cheeses, or scrambled eggs topped with your favorite cheese for a tasty and healthy meal. Though eggs have many nutrients, they lack fiber and vitamin C. Apples are a great friend for eggs since they have lots of both. Fiber especially helps you poop by moving food through your gut and also helps remove bad cholesterol from your body, lowering the risk of heart diseases like hardened arteries, heart attacks, and strokes. The mix of eggs and apples helps break down proteins. Some people feel their stomach is blocked and have trouble digesting after eating eggs. In these cases, having an apple with them will help digestion by making your stomach produce more digestive juices. Try having a sliced apple with your morning eggs, or make an apple and egg salad for a cool and healthy meal. Lastly, how you cook eggs is also really important. It's crucial to cook eggs in a way that keeps as many nutrients as possible without destroying them. Don't eat raw eggs because you might get sick from bacteria like salmonella. Frying eggs isn't recommended because it can make harmful compounds and reduce the availability of some nutrients. Boiling and steaming are good methods, but soft-boiled eggs are better than hard-boiled eggs that are rubbery. Soft boiling keeps more nutrients and makes the eggs easier to digest. When frying eggs, use oils high in omega-3 like olive oil or flaxseed oil. These oils are healthy and also help your body absorb the vitamins in eggs that need fat to be absorbed. To sum up, use pumpkin instead of flour products like bread with eggs for the best brain and eye health benefits. Choose cheese instead of soy products like tofu or soy milk with eggs for a perfect nutrient balance. Never eat eggs with tea or apricots, but pair them with apples for better digestion and overall health. Thank you for your time. I hope this information helps you take good care of your health. Small changes in how we pair and cook our foods can greatly improve our long-term health and well-being. Remember, small diet changes can have a big impact on your health. So let's make every meal count. Thanks for watching and here's to your health. If you found this video helpful, please subscribe, like, and share it with your friends and family. Your support helps us reach more people with this important health information.